So someone asked for a tour of my basement music setup, and uh, it's a little bit of a mess, as I just bought the house a couple weeks ago, and uh, looking to build a new room, but I'll take you anyway. So as we walk down, we're greeted by, of course, pork pie. It's my, uh, I love pork pie. I've got my premiere kit, then my daughter's sonar martini. She's two years old. It's my favorite thing. Uh, and then I have my practice sonar. Uh, this kit now is 31 years old this year, maybe 32. I don't use the bass drum. I use a practice pad, but I can't get the pad to stop sliding, so I stuck some weights on there. Well, here, I'll give you the, the whole shot here. So there's, there's some of my kits all lined up, all along with my wood shop. I'll show you that. Uh, my practice kit consists of uh, mesh heads and the L80 cymbals. I just got a new hi-hat to match uh, my pedals, so I got the DW5000s. I turned a bookshelf or an old TV entertainment shelf into a, a nice little stand for all of my parts, bags, um, miscellaneous pieces. Got my PDP kit down here. My wall of snare drums, I guess as I call it. <laughs> Some of my extra hoops. My favorite, the pork pie uh, zebra wood and rosewood kit. Uh, and then I've got two Sabian cymbal trees. Actually, technically I got, I got three. I got this one over here. But it's definitely much older, so I don't have anything on there right now. Um, this one's cool. It's got spots for spare drum heads, so I got some spare heads down there. And uh, just a stereo in the corner. Um, nothing too crazy, except for this nice big subwoofer back here. But this is, uh, this is my setup. So here's my pork pie from behind. And then here's my PDP kit. My Yamaha kit, I don't leave here at my house. I don't have the room yet until I figure out how to better fit all these drums. If we walk over here, here's a little wood shop. Here's a drum set. I just picked this up. I don't know if you might have seen it, but I got this shell kit for 20 bucks. Um, I took off all the hardware and all the wrap the other day. And then here are some of the new snare drums I'm working on. A couple of staves. That'll be fun to get those finished. But this is my setup. What are uh, what are your guys' setups like? Drum chart. Got to have a drum chart. Any questions, feel free to ask. But this is it. This is my basement. It's a mess, but it'll get there eventually.